in phase. Sorry. What did she say? It's sorry, it was yeah. just the webinar recording. <laughs> okay. All right. So um what was I talking about? I have this model here. This is our best and most modern model. It has built-in speaker phone, but I do have other models available if people only have a landline. So some people still just have like an old tiny landline. And I do have a model available for that. So we do have the most convenient and user-friendly interface. If you see the one on the commercial, their screen is smaller and their icons are along the side. Our icons are here, so it's a lot more like user-friendly. And I like to tell everybody we're all part-time cashiers at Walmart now, okay? So we all know how to use a touch screen. And that's exactly the, the technology that we use, and everything's labeled. So that's really user friendly. And then we have 24 7 customer service at the touch of a button, where the blue button is there on the phone. <laughs> and so um, when I'm finished doing this presentation, you guys are welcome to come up here and play around with the phone that's in demo mode, and I can show you, you know, more detailed features. But we do have 24-hour customer service based in Wisconsin. So it's English as a first language, and they're all trained to speak with uh, people with having hearing loss. Um, and we're also made in the USA. Oh, and this is the big one, the no landline, no problem. So everybody looks at this phone. Whenever I'm at an event or anywhere, they like to tell me, oh, I love this phone, but I got rid of my landline. Well, the good news is if you have the internet, I can give you a free phone number to this phone. That'll be connected to emergency services in your area. And wherever you go, if you, let's say you go to Florida, you move to a different apartment, whatever, this phone and phone number would be the same. And as long as you have an internet signal and power, you always have a phone line. Next slide. And these are the different models I was talking about. So it's very rare these days that I put in the um, traditional smaller white phone. That's our 840 model. But that is for people who never got the internet and still kept their landline. So that's available. This one in the middle is available for people with maybe also um, vision loss. So that screen is a little bit bigger than this screen. But they also have the feature on the modern phone here to make the font larger and smaller. So it's, it's also you know, capable of that. So this is the 840i and the 840. That's what I was saying. This is for people, so it might not apply to anybody here. If you're thinking of someone that still has a landline phone and has a hard hearing. And remember, we are in all 50 states. So even if I don't do the installation, somebody else does. And then the 840i, that will just work with their internet. So some people are comfortable with like, that's more like a flip phone, where this is like a smartphone or an iPad. And I try to give everybody this one, even if they say, well, I'm not good with pictures. Because, you know, this is where, this is everything. This is everything. Gas station, grocery store, Secretary of State, you know, doctor's office, everybody gives you a, a touch screen or an iPad. So I'm just hoping that people get comfortable in their homes with this one. And this is the one that we're talking about here. So it has the touch screen, a built in speaker phone, built in answering machine. All of the phones have a built in answering machine. Yes, and that's the one that is just a little bit bigger for people with visual problems. You might need a little bit extra. Okay, so our phones, and I guess I'll just show you guys here, are four times louder than a regular phone. You can adjust the tone. So sometimes it's not the volume of somebody's voice, it's the tone or the pitch. And I hear that a lot with people. They say, well, you know, I have, um, I can't, I can hear them, but I can't make out the words. 
So that's the problem there, and that's usually tone and pitch. And you might be talking to someone with a high voice, and you might have lost your hearing in the high registers. So that's another thing that you can do is adjust the tone according to where your hearing's at, where their voice is at, if they're wearing hearing aids, if you're wearing hearing aids, that sort of thing. Um, so this like, phone here is going to hook up to your internet, and I'll give you a phone number. But if you already have a phone number, you can just keep using the one you have. Some people aren't just married to their phone number. They've had it for 30 years, and they don't want to change. And that's fine. I'll just add the phone to the phones you're currently using. And let's say you have cordless phones in the house. I'll just connect it so you can use your cordless phone. And then if you were having a hard time hearing, you could walk over to your captel. So the captions are available in English and in Spanish. We do have speed dial and redial re and the mute buttons. And you'll see, it's hard to see because you guys are back there, but um, there's a built-in phone book. You can program in four speed dials, 10 favorites, 100 contacts, and it captions word for word what they're saying and stores it for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is just an example of how the um, captioning works. So it used to be that when someone called you, there would be a caption assistant that automatically came on the line and went over the captions and was typing it for you. Well, now with AI, there's auto captions. So the first thing is auto captions. And whenever I install the phone for anybody, I put it on auto captions which just means talk, like talk to text on your cell phone. But as we know, like talk to text isn't always accurate. So there is the option now on every phone call to have an assistant captions. So that's another feature of ours. And then like I said before, I'm not sure if you guys heard this part, but this is the important part, it is free. <laughs> Free, F R E E. Right. And now, and here we go. Exactly. No, there's no charge for minutes. There's no monthly charge. You're not charged for the phone. You're not going to get a bill from your internet company or your cell phone company or your phone line. It's 100% free. And I know everybody's skeptical of that. And I was skeptical of that too. I was like, why is it free? It's through the Americans with Disabilities Act that provides these phones for free. Yes, ma'am? Yeah, we do. Free calls, so we've been oh, in for five years, I believe. Okay. Six years, I haven't paid kids. Thank so. you. <laughs> Thank you. You should come to all the events with me. <laughs> spend all my time, they say, oh, well, how much does it cost? And like, well, right here, it says no cost. But I know it's hard to believe. <laughs> Your husband loves it. And it's helpful, right? No, you have to have internet. Some people call it like a free internet. Oh, right, through the ACP. Through the ACP, yeah, you don't conflict with that at all. Because I know if you get the ACP internet and then you get like an iPad and they cut off your internet, it's not like that. It has nothing to do with that. So it's a simple process. If you guys are interested in getting a phone, I do the installations, I do the training, I do the outreach. I have forms here. You give me your name and address and phone number, and then I come to your house. Put the phone in, I'll show you how to use it. I'll add your contact, we'll, you know, we'll practice it. And I always say, we'll be best friends, but easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Um, so I have these certificates if you're interested in getting a phone and then I guess anybody at home can email me or if you guys know anybody that needs a phone and they're not in Michigan you know you can let me know and I can call them too. For the folks online are you able to repeat the questions that are asked in the audience? Oh, oh they didn't hear the question so um oh the question was if you are receiving the internet through the ACP Will you be disconnected from that if you add the captel to that? And the answer is no, you will not. It has nothing to do with that. 
Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Yeah, she think that that's not her area, so we'll talk about that. Yeah. Oh, and this is just what I said. I see, I come to your house, put the phone in that screen. If you have any problems, you can always, you know, hit the customer service button. And if they can't help you, then they'll send me out. So that's basically it. Oh, these are some of the testimonials. So they got mine. Mine is better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of testimonials. Well, I can tell you, I've been doing this for six years, and I get a lot of phone calls from people that are just so grateful. First of all, they thought, you know, oh, I don't need this phone. I'm here good enough. Turns out, when you get this phone, you realize what you have been missing, and then you can go back and review it. So right while you're on the phone speaking, you can double check and see what was said. You can pause the captions if you need to get caught back up and you can go back and review it days later. So if a doctor calls you today and rescheduled your appointment for next week and next week comes and nobody remembers anything, you can always go back. But a lot of the other testimonials I'll get is, you know, I wish I would have done this sooner. Um, you know, I didn't realize I had such a hard time with it. And a lot of people stop answering the phone. You know, I talk to the sons and daughters of many people with hearing loss, and they say, well, my dad doesn't talk on the phone. Well, because your dad can't hear on the phone. So don't think, oh, well, I never use the phone. You know, I don't need this phone. You know, if you're somebody who needs someone to listen to your messages or you want someone to help you on the phone, you probably need the phone, and that's just going to give you that much more independence. Oh, yeah. How do I qualify to get one of these books? So, all you have to do is have hearing loss and be American. That's it. So before COVID, we had to go to the doctor or a nurse or a veteran service officer to sign off and certify a degree of hearing loss. That's not the case anymore. So after COVID, they lessened that restriction. So if you tell me your hearing loss and you want to get this phone, that's it. No. Mm -mm, they made it. I guess because people couldn't get to the doctor and we couldn't get inside their houses. And a lot of people are very dependent on the captions. I think they had to do away with the app. And I honestly don't think anybody's going to want this big phone unless you really need it. Any other questions? Yes, ma'am. Yes. yes. Oh, yeah. They were asking if the card was, um, my information was in the and yes, it is. You have to pay for Yeah, I have everything here. I just figured I'd keep it right here. <laughs> and the people online want to sign up, tell them to put it in the chat. Oh, okay. If people online want to sign up for the phone, just go ahead and put that in the chat. You can put your name and phone number, and I'll reach out to you. Or you can feel free to call or text me or send me an email. Any other questions? Are there questions online? I'm waiting to see. I'll let you know if any come through. Uh, for anybody online, I just allowed anyone to speak, so feel free to unmute yourself if you have any questions. Okay, is that it? Okay, thank you, Oh my God.
Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, before we hop off, I'm going to talk a little bit about our program. So uh, for the Flint Healthier Black Elders, if you are over the age of 55 years old and interested in free community health events, such as you know today's Lunch and Learns or how to be involved in non-invasive health research, please feel free to reach out to us. Uh, Ms. Cynthia is there in person. She can at answer all of your questions or you can visit us at www.engageus.org or you can call our phone at 810-309-8693. If you do sign up, you will receive a $20 gift card and yeah, even if you just want to join and, you know, get involved in our different events, you know, we can take your email, whatever is easiest for us to stay connected. And our work is supported by the Michigan Center for Urban African American Aging Research and the National Institute on Aging. Aside from our website, uh, website, you can also find us on YouTube at the Healthier Black Elders Flint Program, where we have different recordings from our different events that we've had over the years, as well as our symposium and a bunch of other videos. So again, we'd like to thank everybody for joining us. We really appreciate everyone's patience and I can stay on the line for a little bit longer if folks online have any other questions for Deborah. And we hope everyone has a wonderful Valentine's Day too. Awesome, thank you so much, Elena. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you, Ms. Yes and members for coming in for this presentation. Deborah will be here a while and able to answer all of your questions or concerns or demonstrate or whatever needs to be done. Um, before you leave though, you know, if you signed in on the computer, I need everyone to sign in on the sign-in sheet for me, please. I think you need eight ten on your screen. So before you leave. So for now, we are ready for